My name is Christina Zeidler. I'm the proprietor of the Gladstone Hotel. Um, it's a boutique hotel, an art hotel in Toronto, um, and it's the oldest continuously operating hotel in Toronto. It's 125 years young. Uh, it's, uh, it originally was a train hotel, so if you look at the architecture of the building, it, w it all faced uh, the railway tracks, which seems sort of strange now, but if you think of when it started, the train tracks were like the internet of the day. All communication, all goods and services, everything came on the train. Uh, my father is an architect. Um, he's actually sort of a modernist and postmodernist architect in Canada. Um, and but he's always been interested in old buildings and the role of buildings in a neighborhood that a building doesn't stand alone it's part of a larger idea um, and we as a family have always thought about urban planning and about the ideas of uh, Jane Jacobs who's a famous urbanist um, and Jane Jacobs said that old ideas can sometimes use new buildings but new ideas must use old buildings. And to me, that's always been sort of the motto of the Gladstone. It's this beautiful old building, but it's a place for new ideas. I think what sets us apart is uh, that we are not just a place for to show art um, or you know, to have art on the walls or just a boutique hotel, but really a place where you can engage with the neighborhood. So I think a lot of travelers, myself included, when you go to see, uh, visit a city, you want to kind of know the flavor of the city. You want to get to know the locals. What's it like to live in that area? <clears throat> and the Gladstone does that. You know, we're not a Disneyland experience. You don't land here and then we show you nothing else. We want you to engage with the locals. So. Um, if you stay here in one of our amazing artist designed hotel rooms, you'll also visit um, art shows and local artists will be here and downstairs in the cafe you'll meet local people so you're immersed in the, in the experience of being in the neighborhood of Parkdale and Queen West. <laughs> We have four floors of the hotel, so the top two floors are our permanent hotel rooms, uh, each one designed by uh, a different artist, so completely designed and you'll and you see them. Uh, the second floor of the hotel where we're sitting right now is a flex space, so it used to be um, hotel rooms, but now they're used for everything from artist studios to exhibition space to meeting space. Um, to temporary offices um, and then on the main floor we have um, a bar, the Melody Bar, which is where our famous karaoke is every weekend and then we have a cafe space that is a, a restaurant space and a ballroom which is where we have a lot of the events and sometimes we open up the door and you can have an event all the way through the cafe and the ballroom. Very grand. You know, I had such a strong vision for this business, and so being here, while we all sit here and, and it exists, it seems to all of us like it has always existed, but the, the journey from where we were to now has been so massive, and sometimes part of uh, a personal journey is, is looking at that path and realizing that you actually did get there. You know, sometimes you have to put the blinders on and just get yourself there and to smell the roses a little bit. <laughs> uh, my name is Christina Zeidler, and as a child, I always wanted to grow up to be an artist, and here I am. It looks a little different than what I thought it was gonna look like, but I love it, and uh, dreams do come true.